Assalamu alaikum dear students welcome to all of you in our third video lecture today our exercise is 5.3 oh, that is about sum and product clear um, we are given a, a three time expression called trinomial here look at the question question number two we are having x squared plus x minus 12 here we will factorize this 12 by making a chart of it sum and product. We will take a pair of factors whose product gives us minus 12 and whose sum gives us plus 1. Right? Because the coefficient of plus x is plus 1. So, 4 threes are 12 and 4 minus 3 gives us 1 as sign of greater term so plus 1 so plus 4 and minus 3 plus 4 and minus 3 right so x square this one be applicable this one will be applicable this one will be applicable x square plus 4x minus 3x minus 12 you can check it plus 4 minus 3x plus 1x again taking x from the first group and minus 3 from the second group always take the sign of third term as common and after taking out as common it must be multiplied by the sign of the fourth term so taking x from the first group we will have only x plus 4 and by taking out minus 3 as common factor we will left only with x plus 4 how minus 3 is common here 3 ones are 3 and 3 fourths are 12 so table of 3 is common here no variable is common here x as it is minus minus plus and 3 fourths are 12 now x plus 4 is common to both so for one time and collect them in a bracket x minus 3 which is our final answer same is the procedure for the second one but it is a little bit changed from the first one here in this question we have 4x squared plus 8x plus 3 what is the what is the difference between 2 and 5 here the difference is we are given coefficient 1 of the x square here the coefficient of x square is greater than 4 so for this for your convenience give them name as a b and c the coefficient of x and the constant c right multiply a and c a multiplied by c what is a and c here that is 4 and 3 4 threes are 12 now take the factors of 12 other than 4 it might be 4 and 3 it's okay that gives you b that is 8 so we will make a chart sum and product the fact the pair of factors whose product gives us 12 right and whose sum gives us plus 8 so that is 2 6 are 12 and 2 plus 6 gives us 8 so this one will be applicable 4x squared plus 2x plus 6x plus 3 now regroup them group 1 and group 2 what is common in group 1 that is 2x and in group 2 3 is common 2x common 2x plus 1 left out 2 2's are 4x common plus 2 1's are 2 and x out now plus 3 is common so 3 2's are 6 plus 3 1's are 3 2x plus 1 one time and 2x plus 3 as it uh, collect them in a bracket so this is our final answer now question number 6 10 y square minus 3 y minus 1 here the coefficient of y square is also greater than 1 first we will rewrite the question and name it as a b and constant c we will take the product of a c 10 ones are 10 now we will take the factors of 10 other than 10 and 1 whose product gives us 10 and whose sum gives us minus 3. So, 2 5s are 10 and 2 minus 5 gives us minus 3. So, this one is applicable. 10y squared plus 2y minus 5y minus 1. We will take 2y common from the first group and minus 1 from the second group. Here, 2 5s are 10 and 2 1s are 2. So, 2 y is common here. 2 5s are 10. Y plus 2 ones are 2. Here, nothing is common. So, 1 is common. And sign of third term definitely common. That is minus. Minus 1 common. 5 y as it is. Minus minus. Plus plus 1. 5 plus 1. 1 time. And 2 y minus 1 in a separate bracket. Which is our final answer. Now, going ahead. And question number 8. 
question number eight look at the question number eight very carefully we are given 2xy square plus 8xy minus 24x here 2 is common because all the coefficients are divisible by 2 2 ones are 2 2 fours are 8 and 2 ones are 2 2 twos are 4 means 2 twelves are 24 x and x is also common here x1 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 is common to thrice so taking 2x as common factor first taking out 2x as common factor we are we have a y square plus 4y minus 12 now we will factorize this 12 12 we will take a pair of factors whose product whose product gives us 12 minus 12 and whose sum gives us plus 4 not 4 threes are 12 because 4 plus 3 gives us 7 not 4 so we will take 6 twos are 12 6 twos are 12 6 twos are 12 minus 2 minus 6 now we need plus 4 here so plus 6 minus 2 plus minus minus 6 minus 2 gives us 4 and sign of greater term and plus minus minus 6 twos are 12 minus 12 so this one is applicable here y square plus 6y minus 2y minus 12 y is common here y plus 6 left out minus 2 common here y plus 6 left out y plus 6 and y minus 2 final answer now question number 9 2 plus 5t minus 12t square first we will rewrite the question now we will rearrange it minus 3 minus 12t square plus 5t and sign of 2 is definitely plus right now the first term is with minus sign so first we will take minus sign as common minus sign as common 12 t square minus plus minus minus 5 t minus plus minus minus 2 minus 2 right so now we will regroup them now we will regroup them now we will regroup them and what is common from group 1 what is common from group 1 that is 3t and from group 2 minus 2 is common definitely the sign of third term, uh, third term is common so 3t is common here 3 fours are 12 and t square so t1 out t1 left out 3t taken as common now minus 2 is common 2 fours are 8t as it is minus minus plus and 2 ones are 2 4t plus 1 and 4t plus 1 is common here so for one time and collect 3 2 and minus 2 in a separate a separate bracket which is our final answer hope you all will be clear about these questions now question number 12 look at very carefully uh, this question 4x8 y10 minus 40 x5 y7 plus 84 x square y4 look at the coefficients of these expression 4 ones are 4, 4 tenths are 40 and 4 twenty ones are 84. Now least power of variables x8, x5, x square means x square is the least power will be taken out as common. Now y10, y7 and y4, y4 is the least power so it will be taken as common. So now 4x square y4 as common factor taking them out. Now 4x square y4 out. So here we are left only with 4 ones are 4 and from x8 x square out so x6 left and from y10 y4 left so uh, y4 out so y6 left. Now 4 tens are 40 from x5 x2 out so x3 left and from y7 y4 left so y3 left here right and x2 y4 out so only 21 left here now we will factorize this 21 here we will make a chart and take a pair of factor whose product gives us plus 21 and whose sum gives us minus 10 now what are these factors these are 3 sevens are 21 right and 3 plus 7 gives us 10 but we need minus 10 so minus 3 minus 7 gives us minus 10 minus 3 minus 7 product gives us plus 21 because in product operational sign resultant operational sign only now 4x square y4 as it is and instead of 10x cube y cube we will write 3 and 7 we will open it right now we will regroup them group 1 and group 2 what is common in group 1 
Look at here, x6 and y6. We will split it. 3 2s are 6 and 3 2s are 6. Right? Look at here. x6, y6. x cube, y. 3 2s are 6 and 3 2s are 6. So, x cube, y cube, whole square. By using glass of exponent, we can write it as it is. We can write it in this form. Okay. Now, x cube, y cube, whole square. Right. What is common here? x cube, y cube is common here. By taking it common, we are left only here with x cube, y cube minus 3 and Minus 7 is common here. 7 ones are 7, 7 threes are 21, right? So, x cube, my, y cube minus 3 is common to both for one time and x cube, y cube minus 7. Collect them in a separate bracket, which is our final answer. Hope you all will be clear about this question. Thank you.